Hi guys, got a long one for you today. This one's against Quirky Quagsire, who I met on Abra's Asylum. Um, anyway, this is an interesting battle, if only because I made a big mistake at one point. Um, but I hope you enjoy it anyway. So anyway, uh... Quirky Quagsire leads off with his Hitmon Top, nicknamed Dreidel. Uh, kudos on the choice of nickname, although as a member of the tribe I cannot necessarily condone that unorthodox spelling. Um, but anyway, I lead off with my Foop, my uh, Denshura, and it gets a uh, it does a it gets a lot of damage from that um, what should I call it? Uh, fake out. I was not expecting that much, but technician boosted. You know, it does a lot. Anyway, I went ahead and used thunder, not predicting the switch, uh, which cost me big. Um, and his rar, his um, crap. I have the name right in front of me. Uh, crocodile. Um, yeah, uh, it gets off a of pursuit before I'm able to attack. That thing is fast, man. But anyway, uh, I use energy ball instead of bug buzz. Big mistake. Bug Buzz would have also been super effective and would have killed him. Instead, he's left with just a little bit of HP, but, you know, he's going to be able to use him later in the match. So anyway, I go ahead and send in Puff, my magic Dragonite. Uh, may or may not live by the sea, I don't know. Uh, and uh, my opponent decides to withdraw um, it, his uh, Crocodile and sends out Derpin Dave, the bane of my existence, uh, a Quagsire. But you know, I'm not really fearing too much from this Quagsire. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, you know, I mean, it's probably gonna Ice Beam me, but you know, what the heck, it doesn't have that much offenses. I think I can take it out, although I do decide I'm gonna pull him back because Leda, my Gardevoir, uh, yeah, everyone say hi to my new Gardevoir. Uh, this is not, uh, the Gardevoir that I had in PBR. Um, this is a new breed, non-trick room. Uh, that's basically the big difference. Anyway, um, carries a red card. Not necessarily the best of items. I'm not sure whether I'll switch it out for something else. It's so that my team can obey item clause, but it doesn't really work too well because, you know, uh, if you're going to attack, uh, if you're going to want to put it, you know, if you're slower than your opponent, which is very likely with Gardevoir, um, you're not going to want to attack when you don't know what the person is. Anyway, um, Leda, who is pretty much my only counter to, uh, my only solid counter to Derp and Dave, gets taken out by a Sucker Punch. I really misplayed, um, and that's a big shame. So, so anyway, I go ahead and send my Puff back out, and I figure, you know, this guy can't really do much to me, so I'm gonna go ahead and Dragon Dance, um, get my stats up. Uh, you, now, Leda has, um, Trace. So I was able to see that Derp and Dave's ability was unaware. It's its new Dream World ability. And I guess it's mine as well, because I forgot that I th confused unaware with simple, I guess, because I thought, oh, it just means that any you know, stat boosts are going to be doubled. So it's probably a curse set or something. But no, what unaware does is it's the reverse. It ignores all of my stat boots, boosts except for, I think, speed. So... I'm, you know, getting all these dragon dances off. I'm like, oh yeah, he's just letting me set up, and I'm gonna kick his ass. Um, but they're not gonna do anything because he's got unaware. So I do eventually figure it out um, when I go ahead and attack him with Dragon Claw, and I'm like, yeah, as you're about to see, it's like it does nothing, and it's like, what? Why is not it doing anything? I was like, wow, that guy must have amazing defenses. Um, but yeah, Derp and Dave yawns me, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and keep attacking because I've got the Lumberry, and I'm not really fearing the sleep. So I go ahead and get off another Dragon Dance because I haven't quite figured it out yet. I haven't quite figured it out. Um, so I get off another boost, um, which isn't going to help me at all. Derp and Dave carries Recover, and so there's, this thing is going to be impossible to kill because I don't think any of my Pokemon have a move that's a two-hit KO on this guy. So, yeah. So I get put to sleep, but I'm going to wake right back up, thanks to my Lumberry. Uh, it's it's a quite nice uh, item, and protects me from par paralysis and all that nice stuff. So anyway, I go ahead and Dragon Claw, and I'm like, okay, this has got to kill him, right? This is going to kill him hard, and then it doesn't. And I'm like, oh, this is when I figure out, oh yeah, that's what Unaware is. Unaware is not simple. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Um, but yeah, so... I'm going to have to pull out Dragonite, because Dragonite's not going to be able to do anything against this guy. And I look through my team, and I'm like, well, no one's going to be able to do anything against this guy. I'm completely screwed. So I go ahead and send out Ikea, which is my Chandelure, um, and, you know, 
I'm hoping that with its massive special attack, it'll be able to to hit KO. Although this guy can KO me with any number, any move. You know, if he if he carries Surf or Waterfall or anything. Um, I guess uh, my opponent was fearing that I might be Spexed and might be carrying Energy Ball because uh, switched out to uh, Urugumosu. Sorry, it's called a Volcarona, although I think Urugumosu is a way better ass name. Um, and so, but I wasn't going for the um, Fire Blast. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. He has um, Flame Body, not Flash Fire. But anyway, um, yeah, didn't realize that I had a Balloon there, so. Uh, stupidity is contagious, I guess. I had gone for a Stab Shadow Ball, and it does enough to 2 KO this guy. Um, but I don't know whether it's going to be enough to KO Derping Dave. Uh, so anyway, uh, he goes ahead and sends out his rawr, his sand, uh, not sand dial, um, crocodile. And anyway, uh, I figure that he's going to use Pursuit, and so I'm going to stay in, thinking that my best chance of surviving is staying in. And indeed, I do survive, although, he, excuse me, he breaks my balloon. I go ahead and use fl a Fire um, Blast. Um, don't know why I use that rather than a move with 100% accuracy, but I do manage to take him out, which is good. So next up for him is a Latios. I cannot wait until this thing is back in Ubers. But anyway, it's faster than me, obviously. So it gets off a Dragon Pulse, and that's going to be enough to KO my Ikea, uh, my Chandelure. Um, yeah, Uber for life. I agree with that nickname. Um, but yeah, anyway, I go ahead and send out River, which is my uh, uh, choice scarf, Kajondo. Um, predicting uh, something that would not be good for him, uh, my opponent goes ahead and switches back to Derp and Dave. And I'm going to go ahead and U turn, um, which just basically for the super effective hit against Latios, even though he switched. Um, yeah, my. Uh, but anyway, it doesn't do enough to even to a KO with a crit, so I've got no hope at this point. I go ahead and send out Puff. I don't know, I guess I'm hoping for a crit. It would have to be a really, really big crit. But yeah, this is not going to be a good match and until I can figure out a way to KO that Derp and Dave, and there is no way. Uh, there is no way. So yeah, Dragon Claw does not get a, uh, a crit, and he's going to go ahead and recover off more damage than I dealt. Um, and so this is going to be a very long uh, stretch of the battle. Uh, if you want to skip ahead, go ahead. Um, <laughs> you know, otherwise you just listen to my voice, um, which I know it's so mellifluous. Is that a word? I don't know. I'm making shit up. Uh, I don't know why I'm cursing today. I usually try to do better about that. There are potentially kids in the audience. Anyway, Derp and Dave goes ahead and yawns um, on my switch, and so I'm going to have to I'm going to have to switch out with a U-turn. Um, yeah, Derp and Dave's just recovering his uh, HP and with leftovers and with everything else, so there's no way that I'm going to be able to take this guy out. Um, but I do go ahead and bring him down to about 50% HP with a U-turn. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and switch back into my Puff, my Magic Dragonite. Basically, between the yawns, I just don't want to go, I just don't want to go to sleep. Um, something that, it, well, no, actually, sorry, I was going to say that something that occurs to me in retrospect is that I've got that Caracosta who's got water moves, which are at least neutrally effective. Um, but, no, that's not going to help me. Um, but, yeah, I go ahead and send River back out, just basically dodging the yawns. Um, and finally, I guess my opponent just was sick of this stall war and decided to end it by switching in his Hitmon top um, and go ahead, goes ahead and fakes me out. And I figure I can survive because, you know, River's got a lot of HP. Um, but yeah, so I do survive uh, after the flinch. And instead of pulling, you know, just straight pulling out as I should have done, I stayed in and forgetting about the mock punch. And the mock punch is going to be enough to take me out thanks to Technician. So yeah, I've completely wasted my Kajundo, uh, and that sucks. So next up for me is my Caracosta, my only hope in the world. Um, he pulls back his dreidel, um, and, you know, I'm just hoping that I can do something. Uh, I wasn't predicting the switch, otherwise I would have never have done the shell break. Um, but yeah, that is at least going to raise my speed, um, so I am going to be faster than his Derp and Dave. Although, I think, actually, I don't know what Quagsire's base uh, speed is off the top of my head. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, use Earthquake, just figuring, well, you know, it is an adamant Caracosta running max attack. Maybe the uh, the earthquake will do more than a two hit KO. Uh, it doesn't. 
as you can see. Uh, and so I get yawned, but I'm sick of all this switching bullshit. Um, again, w watch my language. Wow, I'm really sorry, any kids in the audience. Please don't tell your parents that I'm cursing. Um, but anyway, yeah, I go ahead and leave my HCHB, my Caracosta, in, um, because there's nothing I can do. Um, and, you know, this match is basically over. Uh, and so I'm going to, I'm going to get put to sleep. Um, and I'm hoping at least that that discourages him from using yawn, uh, because that would break, um, that would break sleep claws. Um, yeah, I can't wait until the, P the fifth gen Wii battle system comes out, because hopefully then you'll be able to actually set sleep claws rather than having to rely on the honesty of your opponent. Anyway, um, out goes Latios, um, since I'm asleep and I don't think he really can do anything to me, um... But anyway, uh, Uber for life, that Latios uses Energy Ball, which is going to do a lot to me. It's going to take me down to my Sturdy. And unless I wake up, that's it. Uh, you know, that's it for my HCHB. Um, and that's it for the match. Um, but anyway, yeah, uh, so he's he's got a Life Orb, which is interesting. But anyway, I do wake up, and I am able to uh, attack with Rock Slide, which, thanks to the fact that I did get the plus two boost um, before... Uh, you know, what's his name? Before uh, Durban Dave came out, I am able to one-hit KO that Latios, so that's kind of an accomplishment. Latios is a huge, huge threat, and really should be banished back to Uber. Anyway, I go ahead and pull HCHP back, because I figure it might be useful in the future. I'm not sure as what. Um, but, you know, it's, it's nice that neither of us set up Stealth Rocks. Um, so, you know, we're doing all the switching and it's not costing us anything. Um, it's a very different metagame when there are no rocks up. Um, I don't know that I like it better. I think that, you know, when there's too much switching, it, you know, too much is about prediction and, uh, getting inside your opponent's head. But anyway, um, my puff is finally taken out by a sucker punch from that dreidel. Um, and out goes my HCHB. Uh, this is the end of the match. Uh, you know, nothing I can do at this point. Uh, and I get a mock punch to the face, and I am dead. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that long battle. Uh, it was a really good match. Uh, you should probably sub, uh, Quirky Quagsire. Uh, check out his link. Anyway, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. Peace out, guys.